At the end of the world, there is a place so hostile that no country owns it. Explorers call it the last great wilderness on Earth. In artists, it has inspired visions of beauty and of horror with its stunning vistas and mountains of madness. Here, when winter comes, it lasts for months of unbroken darkness. The air is too thin to breathe normally and drops to minus 80 degrees Celsius. No animals can survive. There is no indigenous population. Anyone trapped here when winter comes is out of reach, as no access or rescue is possible at all, be it by ship, airplane, or helicopter. On life or death, there is no escape from the ice. This is isolation. It is like you are on another world. The story of a lifetime. The story of taking the next step towards the stars. Of leaving this world and gaining another one. For by surviving here at the end of the world, we learn how to survive beyond our home planet Earth. Such as on the moon. or on Mars. The future of human spaceflight is here and now. And it is real. Be a part of the adventure. Hi, my name's Beth Healy, medical doctor for ESA at Concordia Station over the past year. Join me on my adventures in Antarctica and prepare yourself to leave this world. <laughs>